ironically, the best thing I could do with this is now that he's actually declared war on me with Brussels, I can find Brussels. Creating of great works. So have you seen those videos going around Facebook like where the guy cuts like the, the quarter in half and he pulls out like an SD card and all that? No. No? So he, he does this weird thing where he like pulls off the layers of zinc on the quarter. Mm -hmm. And there's a micro SD card in there. Which of course, at the year that that quarter was made, as you see in the video, micro SD cards didn't exist. But this guy is sitting here making fun of him. He cut a mask in half. First he pulls out an SD card and then a, a, um, a power supply um, board. And then he pulls out a camera, then a cell phone, then something else. And he just pulled out a, um, car, a jar of cat food. He's just pulling out junk after junk, just making fun of him. He just pulled out a... a, a Impact driver. It's ridiculous. Mm. Just pulled out a back scratcher. Oh, back scratcher. That's nice. Nice touch, but that back scratcher. <laughs> okay, so let's see. What do I. Okay, so you are my finished road. Gonna tell you to do that for now. Uh -huh. I got time to focus on you. Okay. Open fire upon Venice. Open fire upon Venice. Open fire upon Venice. Don't open fire upon Venice. Yeah, I'm trying to get some more cannons over there. It'll be gone in three turns. I, 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 just, I see this. <laughs> I know you do. It's funny. <laughs> yeah, that Dandelo fellow. I was going to leave him the hell alone, but he's been doing some war stuff with you, and I'm starting to get like, eh, hey, maybe I ought to just... I mean, I was winning, and then he pulled out because I and, made the mistake. And then, and then you were losing, and... You know. No, I, I still would have won. I would have regrouped. No, he was healing faster than you could regroup. Yeah, but, I, I mean, I would have had a major setback, yeah, but I still would have won, because he's built zero army. Hey, by the way, guess what? What? You know where I built the Eiffel Tower? Where? New Ramesses. Of course. <laughs> I can't see it, so... Yeah, you can't see it. Guess what, though? It is actually slowly lowering my cultural influence, uh, raising it uh, on you, rather. On me? Yeah. How do you tell your cultural influence on a city? Um, I believe under the cultural victory tab. And now to hunt down those blasted barbarians who stole my worker. 
Yes. City of Suwon will soon pay the ultimate price. Annex the city. Courthouse. Broadcast tower. Mm. Coliseum. Harbor. Bank. Oh, and I suppose I should also tell my guys to fire upon Venice. Fire upon Venice. Invade Venice. And do nothing. All right, then. Yeah. So, the race to beat World of Warcraft's cla uh, Classic's last raid turns into an all-out war as players resort to dirty tactics. Interesting. You've made I, peace with him? Yep, he's on his very last city. <laughs> His very last and weakest city, I might add. <laughs> so I love how World of Warcraft is still starting wars between people. Literally, the oh. Horde, which is a which is a group of people, band together to deny a guild one of the most prestigious of prizes. Yeah, Nothing this turn, damn it. Hey, Charlie, guess it's what? Not, it's not what I said to do, damn it. Annex the city! <laughs> so, how much are you gonna pay me for Venice? You do realize you just literally killed one of my units that was in that city. Actually, I had, no. I didn't. It just returned him to the edge. See? I had told him to enter that city. Charlie, Russian pikeman, right on the edge. Yeah, I see that. I ain't paying you shit for it. I'm not. I did almost all the work. I've been fighting him for over oh, an hour. Okay, okay. Fine, you big baby. But Hold on a sec. Uh, uh, uh. Actually, no, no, no. Wrong one. Wrong one. By the way, I've seen you now are making profit. No, I'm making plus nine. Yeah, huh. How about that? That seemed like a deal to you. How about that? What? I'm sorry, why did you change it from one gold to ten gold? Because... You didn't read it, did you? No, I did. Then why did you up it from 1 to 10? You know, just, just because you had to modify it, I'm going to refuse it. Really? Yeah. Why wouldn't you take more gold? Because I don't want more gold. You confuse me. Charlie, money isn't everything. Well, then make it back down to one. All right, fine. I'll set that. It's fine. Well, that's wonderful, Charlie. Just magical. If I a wasn't... A land ship. Okay. A land ship. What, what do you mean, a land ship? You have a land ship. 
Yeah, right at the edge of your territory. I used it to capture Venice. I rolled it in, captured Venice, and then it got removed out. Because we aren't currently at war, or have open borders. <clears throat> Oof. I'm trying to remember what I was doing now. I completely forgot. Shit. Uh, okay, I've started on him. I know that. I told him to go that way. I was. I was dealing with you. Well, I have conquered the entire southern half of the continent. Now I suppose the northern half will be my goal. What city do you have right to the north of Venice? Uh, actually, I have four cities to the north of I Venice. I know, but I didn't know you even had a city there. Uh, of course, Venice yeah. has zero... San cult. Francisco, Atlanta, Chicago, and Houston. <laughs> and of course, Venice has zero gold as well. Of course, Venice had zero gold. You were destroying him every turn. Not gold, uh, coal. Actually, you know what? I, I just thought of something very fun to do. Hold on. What? Uh, actually, I'll have to do it next turn. Or, or hold on. M maybe, maybe I... There can be no peace. Perhaps another day. Oh, okay. Well, fine. That's what you want. Charlie, what? Brussels is on the other side of the continent from you, from us. It's straight to my west, on my map. Yeah, straight to your west, the other side of the continent. From yes. Uh huh. I literally would have to go through all of what was once Korea to get to that. You can't just ship. Off of the coast from our continent? But that takes so long and it's so annoying. I want the baby, not the labor pains. That you know? sounds terrible. Well, it is terrible. How far away can a frigate attack something? Uh, depends. Open sea? No, I mean, it depends. Um, cities directly on the coast? Uh, two, three tiles. Not enough to stay out of their range, sadly. Okay. That's what I was trying to figure out. Yeah. Yeah, until you get to late game, there's no way to target a city from out of their own range. Oh, Indian archaeologist. Huh. And a missionary. I see Venice is still on the map. What does yeah. he have left? He has a boat somewhere, I'm sure. Actually, I think he may have a boat somewhere on my southern coast. A Galeus. I remembered seeing one. And there goes my knights. Fuck that. You're going to be building these for a while now. Someone needs to come over here and get some production in this city going. You're fine there. You'll be fine for now, anyway. <sighs> I only got three workers, really. Can I, can I just...
That's fine. I'll do that. That's that's fine. Okay. All right. I could do that. At one o'clock in the morning. Perfect. We've declared peace of everyone. I'm now gaining zero gold a turn. Hmm. Yeah. Being in war made me money somehow. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah. Hey, something's about to make you even more upset, by the way. What? Oh, you'll see in a few seconds. Please don't declare war on me. No, no, no. I'm not that heartless. Wait, wait, wait. How do I have... I am so confused. What? Hey, Charlie. Why? why? What the shit? Oh! Oh! What? Okay, this is interesting. Venice. Has... Look to the north of Venice. All I see is clouds. Oh. San Francisco. It's Washington's he... again. How did he capture that, though? It's very interesting. I approached Dandelo, made peace with him, and then I made him an offer to give him the city of San Francisco. And he, and gave he graciously. It and then he gave it to Washington. What the hell? What? I am confused by this. I know. I wanted to see if it would make you mad, me giving Ven Venice a city again. And it did, or probably would have. But then he gave it to Washington. It's so weird. He won't accept an embassy with me either. No. Makes peace with city states. Kind of annoying, but okay. And now I shall pay off. Sejong's debts of 17 gold per turn. What the fuck? What? Do you want... Okay, so this is what Gandhi wants for a peace treaty. He wants four cities along with everything else. You know what? Here, let me get... Let, let me talk with, with Gandhi. Ah, uh, never mind. I got it. Without the cities. You got me. Wait, 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 back. No, no, don't, 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 don't. Wait, wait, stop. I, no. I already have. I've already oh, done it. Oh, god damn it, Charlie. I would have gotten you a, big, a better deal. You're like Not a deep. minute late. Yeah, just like the audio on your art videos. Yeah, they, it. <laughs> <laughs> That's because of how long they go. Brussels and wants something to do with that Charlieism. Game. Brussels wants. <laughs> hey, Charlie, guess what? There's bandits in my city? No. But well, yes, is. but that's not what. What then? Uh. No oh, wait. Brussels is is my ally. Hands off, Dandelo. Yeah. Um, yeah. So Washington's plotting for a sneak attack. And he, he's plotting against you. So That honestly doesn't surprise me. Why me though? I never I waged war with him.
probably because you share a border with him and are economically just bork. Well, I mean, he accepted an embassy with me, but he won't make a defense pact with me. Hmm. Washington, you little bitch. Why is my city half damaged? Oh, never mind. It's because it hasn't been repaired since I got it. Duh. Technically, the city repairs on its own. That is true. By the way, let me see how many how many points I have in the World Congress. Thirteen. <laughs> wow. What? Apparently, the only person who actually oh, that's that's interesting. Bismarck would technically come to benefit with my policies. I still don't know how to see those policies. Charlie. That's because you haven't adopted an ideology. Yeah, I'm aware of that, but there's a way for me to see you don't have adopted and I don't remember how to. Oh, wow. What? So I went to uh, demographics, and under best is your name everywhere. And it has Wait. numbers for average. And then under worst, under approval and literacy is mine. <laughs> On oh, those God. two only. Oh, my God. Best everything. Oh, the worst gross national product, though, has to be Dandelo. Minus 41 per turn. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm like, what? But no, I found it. Really like to have those trade routes back up soon. Yeah, but you know. Yeah. Can't okay. happen. You kind of, kind of destroyed the caravan. So. I had a workship destroyed. Two caravans are still going. No, I I mean you destroyed my caravan. Oh, between um. Venice Here and you? Venice, yeah. Yeah. Why? Great, now there's an American caravan trading with me, damn it. Yeah, I thought that would annoy you. That, that does. So much. However, these musket men, barbarians over here, are going to get a rude awakening when they realize my gun shoots a whole lot faster than theirs. in a second.
So, how's it going? Eh, not too great. Oh, we're waiting on me, aren't we? <laughs> I thought we were waiting on oh, you. Oh, okay then, Bismarck. Fine. I won't be making a deal with you today. What are they trying to do? Oh, I was talking to him about um, a trade deal where he would provide me ivory. Oh. Sadly, it did not come through. He was asking entirely too much. The ivory was not worth it. Oh, uh, also, Washington, um, I may have given him a lot of gold. Why? To keep things interesting. Why do you hate me? Oh, well. And my people. Well. What did my people ever do to you? They breathe. Yeah, and I can't do nothing with Venice for nine more turns. You smell that? <laughs> smells like some vintage bitch. <laughs> Everyone should be in awe of my regal, uh, regality. You know, I don't think anyone's actually successfully circumnavigated the world yet. Probably because it's not possible. I mean, it is, but not by boat. Yeah. So, hmm, who to vote for? Obviously me, for 15 times. Yeah, even though I've paid off most of the debts of all the countries I've walked into and smashed to shit, um, I'm afraid to say that it doesn't look like Pyongyang is going to be recovering back to a world power anytime soon. No, it seems to me that time is over. you haven't said nothing yet. Said nothing about what? Something that wouldn't have made a difference at all because you won anyway. <laughs> oh, well. And I knew you was. Oh, so you voted for yourself. Sure. Well, that's just sad. <laughs> wouldn't have affected nothing. No, it really wouldn't have, but the fact that you voted for yourself means that you still have some self-respect, and I'm afraid I just simply cannot allow that to continue, so I'm going to start upgrading my military on your continent, and we will be marching for Mother Cow. Why? A better question would be, why not? Because there's a hundred other continents. There's a whole other continent you could go take over first. And um, more countries to go kill. You got Washington Yes, to but Gandhi isn't really a problem to me. You got. You could go kill Washington. You could go Actually, kill... Actually, Washington kind of likes me now. Go kill Berlin. You could go kill the Aztecs. Uh, I don't know. Montezuma and my neighbors... 
my neighbor Bismarck to the north has been kind of nice. I, I don't really think I want to go capture them. But what have I done? That's been not nice. Do I need to list it out? <laughs> sure. <sighs> okay, I'll be honest, I got nothing, but still, that doesn't mean... <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you did actually declare war on me once to try and get your city back, only to realize the next turn that, oh, that was a terrible idea. <laughs> like, oh, yeah, uh, that's not gonna happen. Ever. At least for a long time. By the way, I should probably repeal the effects of um, the embargo wine thing. Yeah. If you ever want to sell your wine again, yes. Actually, if I ever want to have happiness from wine. Oh. Yeah. I still get economic benefits from wine. It's the happiness I want, though. Jerusalem looks elsewhere. Jerusalem looks elsewhere. He had a quest for, um... So, um... Yeah. Yes. Well, either way, Charlie, I'm going to begin lining up the cannons. Perhaps I should um <clears throat> take take my latest ship and go go for a little cruise over by Mother Fudger. It should so, be over in a few turns. So, did you see what um in Minneapolis? Sorry, Mi Minneapolis um police safety tips during the crime surge was? Oh yeah, yeah, I saw, and they were appalling. Yeah. I mean, be prepared to give them what they want. No, be prepared to give them everything. Uh, it says be prepared to give up your phone, and then, um, the full article says um your purse and your wallet as well no that's not what you should be doing yeah that's not you should be prepared to pop a fucking cap in their ass in a city where guns are already considered illegal anyway doesn't friggin matter I know if you don't start popping caps in their asses they'll never learn they'll never get better unless they Learned that laws are going to be broken by criminals either way, so why be a good guy? Go ahead and break the law yourself. Well, actually, more I was saying, if the criminals aren't scared of running up and threatening somebody, you know, eventually they're going to run up and threaten somebody and they're just going to whip the pistol out and pop the bitch in the head. You know? That's that's kind of yep. why we have guns, you know? Yeah. To give ourselves physical protection from antagonistic actions from others. Uh-huh. So what do you think could move faster? A, um... A, a barbarian musketman or my Gatling gun? Barbarian musketman. Oh. I won't know because he moved closer to me for some reason. Probably because he wants to attack your shitty musketeer. No, I've got the Gatling oh, gun. Oh, your shitty Gatling gun. Which still has full health. You act as though this makes a difference. Farm will produce food. Move riding pony production to the nearest city. Forest. Okay, so if I construct the farm on a forest it produces food but it says will also be will also provide 20 production to the nearest city is that just a boost or permanent hmm? oh I, I think it's like just temporary production because once you too. oh charlie i'm what? working on something that's going to make you quite unsettled uh that's a lot Oh, and I also have a new spy. Wait. What? 
that is Berlin. Yeah. There we go. Why do you have so many archaeologists? Me? No, India. Oh, probably because they're looking for a tourism victory, but it won't happen. What does archaeologists do? Oh, they let you make little museum exhibits from excavated things. And they up your tourism. Suppose I could take a look and see victory progress. Uh, let's see. Domination. I am in the lead by controlling three of the original capitals. I would have four if I didn't let you have. Do you even Event. see victory progress? Uh, okay, so look, you see to the left of um, when you open up the chat bar, okay, there's the World Congress Diplomacy, Culture Overview, your Social Policies, and then Espionage Overview, right? Uh huh. Okay, to the left of that, additional information. Go all the way down to victory progress. I'm overlooking it completely. I am 54.5% influential over you. Culture-wise. So, my biggest competitor just got thrown off a cliff. Which is what? Uh, um, well, basically, Sejong. Which means now my second biggest competitor is Gandhi. My biggest competitor is Barbarian Musketman, currently, for some reason. I still don't know how this city has a connection to my capital. But okay. I'm doing what the United States is doing, Charlie. And what? we're talking about the actual United States, not the not the fictional Washington United States. Now that I have conquered the world. Are you attacking I'm... now? Nope, I'm paying back. Uh India just took Jerusalem, by the way, as friends. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. Well, thing is, I gave them 80 gold a turn to pay off their debts, and that's only a small drop in the bucket. Yeah, I see that. <laughs> uh... Oh, look. Suppose I should add another tenant. Hmm. I'm thinking avant-garde or civil society. Broadcast tower. Hmm. Opera house. Lighthouse. Uh, and build a farm. And alert. And come over here and repair all that crap next turn. Hmm.
I get fertilizer next turn. Yay. Because I'm so far behind, I haven't even researched basic gardening. It's actually in the industrial area. What the fuck? I did not know that. Everyone gets dragged along to the next era if all the other civilizations ha have reached the next era. Even yeah, though I, you don't have the science. No, like, I haven't finished. Like, I, I'm at the point where I can, legitly. But I, like, I thought, I would have thought that fertilizer was in either the Renaissance or at least the medieval era. Because it's, it's fucking fertilizer. To be honest, we really haven't, uh, we really didn't get into some hardcore farming until we reached the modern era. Science funding and world I ideology freedom. Yep. Hmm, that science funding sure does look interesting, though. Yeah, me and Gandhi are both going to vote yay for freedom. I don't know. I know you are. Freedom loving bastards. So I have such a great mini dungeon planned. No, no, no spoilers. Oh, but it's so good. Yes, well. You get to kill a cultist leader. We already did that. Yes, I didn't design this one. This is I've got uh, two right now that aren't of my design, and then one that isn't of my design that I haven't implemented yet. Like, I didn't write them. They were already written. I was just sent them, and I'm reading over them. But the one, I, I finished reading one of them today, and it's actually really good. A cultist. Wait a minute. So it was sent to you, you said? Uh, yes. Ugh. Son of a bitch, America. Yeah, I gotta make Almaty stop throwing units at me. Hey, uh, can you look to... San Francisco? No, can, can, can you look to Pi Ramsey's, um, self... For me, real quick. You mean the barbarian pikeman? No. Hi, Ramesses. My Amy's down here now. Venice, you'll be fine for a few more turns. Uh, you'll be released in one more turn, but... Not if I just sort of come over here and park Actually, my... Actually, yeah, 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 you fight. Um, yeah, yeah. Let, let me just, let me just park this, this battleship right off your coast. My coast? Yeah, right out, right outside your territory here in the ocean. Let me just park it right here. Oh, oh, Let me see there. if I can shoot. Oh, look, I can. <laughs> that, that's not the did right you city. Just, but did yeah. you just see the barbarian disappear right next to Venice? Oh. That was me firing my boat. I didn't even notice. I was sending guns up there. Uh, no, my, I got Miami to myself now. I thought maybe you you was gonna move through and yeah uh, no no okay well I guess I'm going down there you will lose that's right because he's got a fucking army right here next to me doesn't he yeah he does I wanted to torment you some I figured this would be entertaining I know I can kick Washington's ass but can you kick Washington's ass <laughs> I doubt it.
Oh my, Charlie. So many cities laid to... So much farmland. Oh, Charlie. What? So much perfectly good farmland laid to waste out here on your coastline. What's and this? Venice? No, no, no. Yours. Also, Yo, yeah. hey, look right out off the coast of Mother Fudger, too. Oh, hi there. Hi. You need through. No. Okay. No. No, I can always just attack Mother Fudger, your worker, that little uh, wood outpost on the other side of Mother Fudger from where I am, uh, that little cargo ship right there from Gandhi, that other little cargo ship from Gandhi, uh, Gandhi's worker across the channel, Gandhi's archaeologist across the channel, Gandhi... <laughs> Gandhi sure does have a lot of targets, doesn't he? Yeah. Oh, and then there's this little American cargo ship trading with you. It's also got a rifleman over there. American cargo ship? Yeah, to your north. North of Mother Fudger. I don't see him, so. And it okay. trades with Mother Fudger. That Mother Fudger. Um, right now Miami's weak. It'd be easy to take. No. <laughs> no, I, I think I'd like to just kind of sit back and watch him destroy you. I've already won. I already yep. know you've won. Yeah, I'm kinda already won. Now it's a race for second place. I mean, I have a... Well, technically, I, I don't have something on every continent, but... I mean, I could have that changed very quickly, given the fact that I now have modern... Navy vehicles and uh, planes, and the thing that I'm cooking up in four turns will undoubtedly scare the crap out of everyone. Oh, and I also just completed Statue of Liberty. Oh, this sounds like a job for you. I, I found the request from Jerusalem that you that's perfect for you. You listening? Yeah. Jerusalem wants Antoine bullied. <laughs> oh, silly Charlie. I don't bully any city states. Why not? Because I don't. Picking aside between petty city state squabbles is beneath me. I'm just Charlie. saying. It'll keep your good buddy Jerusalem happy. I already have Jerusalem very happy. With their coffers lined with an obscene amount of gold. 
Okay. And besides, I have a large enough military to deal with any problems. Unless you would like to argue. Can't no. You? Oh my god. What? I now have a reason to go to war with India. Why? He just founded a city to my south. Indrap Rashta. Well, this is gonna take all of five minutes. Once I actually get something over there. Okay, well, I just told him uh, not to um, settle new cities near me, and he told me no. So, you know what that means. What? Means we are about to have an ass-kicking contest. Okay, well, I'm going to sit here and watch. Maybe you should actually get a boat over here or something. I do actually have some frigates being built right there next to him. I just haven't finished them yet. Yeah, you wouldn't be able to come and see. I'm talking about on the center continent. Um, it's not on the central continent. I know. You're over there on the other side. Yeah. Which I, I'm never going to see because you're going to destroy me before I ever even get over there. Well, probably, yeah. Catch on fast. <laughs> Yeah, let me just, uh, you know what, here, I'll just destroy this outdated frigate, and this outdated ironclad, and buy a couple new ones down here closer to where the offending city is. I will purchase a destroyer. Mm -hmm. So it is getting kind of late, Alex. Yeah, it is. So, are we saving the game here? Might as well. Yeah, okay. Sounds like a great place. Let me do a manual save like always. Yep. <sighs> yeah, I can tell you what the video is called. Alex uh, eats the world. <laughs> Yeah, and I go to war. I go to war, and Alex eats the world. That's that's. I how barely it win. Yeah, barely. All right. Well, until then, hope y'all have enjoyed this. I hope you all didn't enjoy it. Uh, probably pretty boring. Bye. Bye.